My name's Christine and I'm a carer. I was the main breadwinner because my husband had sustained an injury through accident at work and I stayed at home and my parents were there elderly. My mother, we knew the dementia was setting in and it came to the point where she had been diagnosed with Alzheimer's. Made the decision that it was really time for me to give up work and finished on the Friday and went with my dad to the hospital on the Tuesday or the Wednesday of the following week and he was given his diagnosis of terminal cancer. And his only wish was that he could be at home, he didn't want to be in hospital, so we managed that. And he died in February, he got his three months. After that, automatic pilot set in because I still had mother and I still had my husband and life still had to go on. But through all of this I had been advised that there were carer centres where I could go and meet other people who were in similar situations. Through that I found out about carers assessments and care assessments, two different things. So I self-referred myself to the local social work department and someone came out, did my mother's care assessment, didn't really go too much into my husband, handed me three sheets of paper, which was my carers assessment. And uh, Christine, when you've got time, fill that in and send it back to me. And I just thought, that's you, dismissed, and put it in the corner. A week or two later, I'd been at the carers' meeting, and wouldn't you know, they came up with a new carers' assessment, and I'm afraid I'd, I'd let my feelings be known. So I was then asked if I would take part in um, going through another carers' assessment, where I met Josephine White. And 